Hi, I'm Gary Testa, President and CEO of Engineered Fluids, and today I want to take you into our shop and lab and show you an actual slick tank operating. We've got 48 miners in an uh, open container using a two-loop cooling system. So I want to walk you through that and show you how it functions, and then I'm going to do a deep dive into actual showing you flow rates, temperature ranges, and how we accomplish this using our electric cool, dielectric cooling. So come on. So what you're seeing here right now is a 48 minor open tank. It's filled with 600 liters of our electric cool EC100 because we're doing both a mix of ASIC miners, which you see here. Earlier we had this set up with GPU miners as well. Okay, so we have 48 miners, two liters a minute. That's 96 liters a minute of fluid is flowing through. It's so small that you can barely see the fluid move from the cooling chamber into the recovery chamber. So what you're looking right down at here is the business end of the tank. This is where we actually have the fluid coming in. You can see the cooled fluid is flowing here, splitting, going through these two valves, and then it's going into the bottom of the tank, up through the bottom of the tank, coming out of the top of the miners, and then back into the recovery channel. Uh, this drop here is to ensure that we get enough input into this. We need to have positive pressure into this pump. Okay, so this is the coolant pump. So it's drawing the fluid out. We're using gravity. So what you'll see here is a, a standard two-loop system. We have the coolant loop coming in, going into the heat exchanger, exiting the heat exchanger cooled. On this side, we have chilled water coming from our dry cooler, okay, coming into the, the heat exchanger and then exiting out here. This temperature, channel one, is our input temperature. So our cool coolant is flowing in here at 37 degrees Celsius. Here, we're exiting the tank at 60 degrees Celsius. So we've got about a 23 degrees C temperature delta. So now what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take you outside and I'm gonna show you the dry cooler. Uh, this is a, uh, a three bay, three fan dry cooler. Because of the temperature outside today, we're only having to run a single fan, okay? Now, that tank is putting out about 67 kilowatts of heat. This dry cooler is capable of cooling over 400 kW. So with a single fan operating about half speed, we're getting more than enough cooling on the inside. This is a, uh, our cooling loop on this side is water-based, 30% glycol. The glycol is here to prevent any kind of freezing. Well, once again, I hope that explanation was helpful. We're always happy to have you come and visit us here at our lab. Uh, just send an email to sales. We'd be happy to uh, set up a time machine. We, I'm hoping this will generate some more questions, and we'll keep making more videos. And again, we really appreciate you as customers, and we look forward to seeing you here at our lab.